Look What's Cooking is brought to you by Culinary Institute of Virginia. Hi, I'm Bonnie Johnson, and I'm here with Chef Hi. Mike Morphew, the director of the Culinary Institute. And what are we making today? Today we're going to make a really nice light summer um, evening dish. It could be lunch. Mm -hmm. um, and we're using, using some local flounder, which is really good at the moment. So we're using local flounder. Um, it's come with a little twist. It's going to be served with some ice grapes, Ooh. which have been soaked in some curacao. So it's going to give a nice little kick to that. And that's going to be served with a reduced cream and herb sauce. It's really, really good. Oh, it sounds yummy. So what are we going to need? Well, what we're going to need, obviously, is some flounder. Mm -hmm. okay. Okay, so we've got some great, great flounder here. Not too large fillets, they're quite small, so they're tender and sweet, they're really nice. Uh, we've got some chopped shallot, or as you guys say, shallot, okay. <laughs> um, we have some uh, chopped mixed herbs in there. I've got some tarragon, parsley, and chives. Uh, obviously ice grapes, and we got some cream and some butter, white okay. wine. Okay, can you tell us how you make this then? Yes, yeah, certainly. Uh, we first we'll take a heavy duty pan, I'm going to grease the bottom with some butter, uh, sprinkle on some chopped shallot, fold my fish and lay it on top. Uh, then I'm going to sprinkle with herbs, a little bit of white wine, and I'm going to cover it with what we call a cartouche, which is actually basically, it's a long word, isn't it? Cartouche. Okay. Yes. Uh, we're going to cover it, it's a grease paper, okay, it helps to keep the steam in, mm -hmm. and then we're going to cook the fish on top of the stove or in the oven. Um, for about two or three minutes, very, very quick cooking. Oh. And then when it's cooked, we take it out, uh, take the fish out, and then we just pour cream in, reduce that down, a few more herbs, pour it over the fish, garnish with the grapes, and there we are. And voila, can we see the yeah. finished product? Now, how long, you said two or three minutes, on the stove it would be on high heat, medium heat? Um, just a mi medium heat, so it's just gently cooking, and it's a better place to put it is start it on top of the stove and then finish it in the oven. Okay. Two well, or three minutes. If you would like to try this at home, it sounds very simple and looks yummy, go to our website, WTKR.com. Look what's cooking.